What's up everybody, this is Rob Shack. So today we're gonna be going through the uh, next max speed test in my game. This is the Ascent 237SI. It's basically a BMW series car, looks like it. It's Emily's second car, so we're gonna just drive around New York a little bit, see what our max speed is for this car, and I'll just kinda of talk a little bit about it. Be sure to like, subscribe, comment, and share, and help me get to a thousand subs. So. Eventually, I'm going to do the thing that I did in New York where I actually compare all the starting cars and the secondary cars and the third cars for New York. They're all way better than New York's cars, if that makes sense, because it would be really funny if they were worse. But um, and this car looks like a mix of a Sylvia S15 and a BMW, so, you know, take with that whatever you want. Uh, this car is essentially the exact same as the first version of the Ascent, but it has more handling and more top speed, so it should be a lot better because basically this acceleration is already amazing, so it should be even better. Um, we'll see though, that'll be, that'll be the test here. Those, those, number, those bars don't really mean anything, like they kind of do, but not super pressing, I guess. Um, but this car is pretty good, I mean the London cars are just so much better, although, although honestly, I haven't really enjoyed using Kareem's cars, they kind of are terrible, but we'll see if that makes a difference. Um, yeah, so definitely uh, Emily's and Luke's cars are way, way better than Kareem's. I mean, this car is getting up to 161 and I'm not even at the max speed yet, so uh, just the weird glitch, the weird uh, physics mechanics of those little pillars in the bridge is hilarious. I don't know if you noticed my car went flying back off of those things, it's pretty funny. So that's why my car is now very, very damaged in the front because I hit those going 160 and that'll do it. So it's pretty great though. This car is cool looking even when it's damaged and this game is really fun. Very arcadey, super fun, easy to get uh, hold of and get used to and basically you just tap through an e-brake and it takes care of itself. Um, it's a fun game though. Uh, good challenge, not impossible. Uh, and. I don't know, I enjoy it. So I'll uh, drive around a little bit more, focus, and try to get my top speed. I have 161 right now. We'll see if that's actually the best. It probably is better, but people have told me, why don't you remove the traffic because it's hilarious to do, hit them in my car. So I'm like, I'm amused by them to the point that I'm like, yeah, sure, I'll leave the traffic in there. Why not? Let's see what happens. Um, and it's always funny when you hit something and then your wheels go flying off and then you just keep dragging. You just like that, or your wheels just are sitting at the little four-man wheel squad behind your car. And then you have to start up again. So it's pretty fun. Y'all are great. Enjoy the rest of the video, and subscribe for more.